YouTube. Um, welcome to my private server launcher tutorial. This is my first video, so I'm pretty excited. Um, I've already got my layout how I want it. I got my X button and then my two launcher buttons. This is really simple. It's only three buttons, so it's not it's not a big deal. Um, I mean, first things first, easiest. These things to cut like like um I put I made it start out center screen and then I got rid of the, the border like you can if you don't have like a layout you can just set your form border style to like um you know single fixed or whatever and you can add more like buttons for each you know drum list is you know not really that hard um first things like the first thing you want to code is um the exit button and uh it's easy, it's just, you know, you close, simple stuff. Um, for your private server button or whatever, I'm going to have dim right um, as new, then system. Streamrunner right here. And then you want to have um, current directory, which is the, fo the folder that the, you know, the exe is going to go in. And you want to have and um, backslash. Don't forget the backslash; it's kind of important. Otherwise, it won't work at all. Such so data slash in us or whatever folder you, is your realmus is in. And then realmus. Oops. And you want to do right dot right um yeah and just set list and then like your IP whatever you want in there. That way it'll close the file after it's done writing it, it'll close it immediately. You want dim app path. Um, equals uh, oh, I just put current directory. Uh, and um we get a backslash. Exe. And then um, I think it's shell, yeah, shell. Yeah, path. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, VB, um, minimized. Yeah, minimized focus. I think. Yes, that's it, yeah. That's it, yeah. Why is it? No, oh, wait, I forgot an I. I forgot a P. I'm tired, I can't type. And, and uh, this one right here will like actually launch. Like, this This changes your own list. This launches the EXE. And then you just, if you want to close at the end, you just stop and you close. And then for your retail button, you can just like copy this over, and then um, just change your IP to retail, and then um, you know save it, come up to build, build, you know. Or sorry, wrong folder. Actually, I'm gonna that later. It's, 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 you know, my actual one right there, but whatever. Come to here. Launch your folder, bin, release. Find your test launch thingy. Paste it. 
and you want to get a want a gun. I want to go to um your raft holder. Uh, and then just copy this in here. That's because I already have a file with the same name in the folder. Alright, and then, um, like if you look at my, uh, we're almost now, it says retail right now. You know, you actually put the IPs in there wherever your IPs are. And then, um, I might mind uh, start center screen. So like, yeah, see, so start center screen, and then um, you know your X button works, and then I'm gonna set it to this one. <laughs> and it, um, that opened my World of Warcraft. Let's see. Yeah. Let's see. And if we go into my um back to my realmus it should say your IP because that's what I put in then. Yep, see your IP. See yep. Um, that's it. Hope I uh, helped at least a little bit. Um I'm gonna go I'm gonna go to bed now.